So yeah, here I could discover how you say this cow, Eid Benin Haddon. <laughs> so this is the clay village. I hope you guys are ready for a bit of walk because this is actually um, quite a windy um, day when we visited um, these clay villages. Um, basically this is all the footages I managed to get. It was extremely hard to record anything due to the wind and obviously we were a part of the tour. Um, so I hope you guys will enjoy it. Yep, yeah. bloody person, bloody sunscreen man. Sure, man. But in this village you can see three with the right day. Hot, windy, some strong, uh, sometime raining because we are between the Atlas Mountain and also in a gate of the desert, okay? Uh, the, the high part of the Atlas Mountain is from this part. Tukkal, 4,167 uh, meters. The middle one, Ambu, 4,000. And the third one, Sirwa, 3,000, okay? And the desert, Merzuga, you are going to Merzuga from this direction and there is also Zagora from this part, the small desert, it's not far from here, just three hours and a half, okay, but nothing there to see, okay, <laughs> and look, uh, from here better to see the, the old castle in south of Morocco, it was built in 11th century, 1100 years ago, name of this village, Ksar Ait Bin Hadou, uh, Ksar means a castle, Eight means a tribe, the first name of a Berber family, okay? Uh, Bin in our tribe, Berber tribe or Jewish tribe, Bin means son of, okay? Mm -hmm. So basically that's the UNESCO bridge that is was built there for this village because there was a problem with electricity and water and now we are heading inside. Um, this is supposed to be the river, basically as you can see it's way too hot. Um, so obviously there is no water at the moment and um, those two gates they were actually in the movies so they actually didn't belong to this uh, village over there so we're gonna be carrying one from there <laughs> These little things are the almond. <laughs> What's that one? Big. Oh. So, uh, the gladiator arena, it was built in a square there. If you see the small square down, just here, the small square. There was quite a few movies shot at this place and I'm gonna be actually showing you guys very shortly the list. One of them is the Gladiator movie from 1999 and I will be showing you where the Colosseum was actually built, basically a fake Colosseum where the oldest fighting team were. Gladiator Arena, okay. The first arena with the Bayern Rustic Cross Leave in a desert. Prince of Persia, Prince of Persia, yeah. it was in the same square with the shooting gladiator. The decoration of Prince of Persia is here, okay. At the Bible, Lawrence of Arabia, okay. And there is Asterix, Obelix, Mission Cleopatra, with German <laughs> Bose, Ali Baba, and Forty Thieves, okay. Game of Thrones Season 3, okay. Yunkai. Yeah. So this was one of uh, the fake wall um, that was in one of the movies and it's left behind basically. So cool. So 
this is what it actually looks like from the very very top. Once we reach the top, um, I asked Cal to walk around to show you guys everything uh, from the top. So this is the view from the highest uh, point uh, from this clay village basically. Okay. Uh, uh, good for tall people. Yeah. yeah. Uh, <laughs> it's the first time. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe just me. Saba. How's it going? No, Greek. It's not Greek, it's a Berber alphabet or Amazigh alphabet. It's different from Arabic, it's similar, like Greek alphabet. Uh, the first people they live in, in North of Africa, Morocco, Tunisia, Algeria, Mauritania, and one part of Mali. It's a Berber people or Amazigh people. In the 7th century, uh, century, the Arabs they bring the Islam to convert the Berber people. Uh, and the Berber they live in just the, the nature. I got the magic. So like magic. Look at the color. See? Wow. Yeah. The black color it's green tea and the yellow it's saffron and the blue it's indigo. Okay? And normally that technique long time ago it's for right the secret missile. This is Facebook from before. <laughs> <laughs> After all this walk in the extremely hot weather, um, we had lunch. Um, honestly, guys, I've been never ever experienced such a pain in my life. Um, I had a toothy infection, so I was honestly in this entire trip um, in Morocco all through the two weeks. I was just in pain between all these videos and pictures, so definitely would not recommend that. After lunch we headed to our next location, um, I'm not even going to try to pronounce this place name um, but I um, can tell you that there is a few movies again um, that was actually created in this area um, I will pop everything in the description box below for you